The truck is loaded. The gear is in. Ready for season two? We made it. Let's go register. Let's sign up. We're at the Alberta shootout. So everyone from Edmonton and Calgary are coming here today to race. It's going to be probably one of the largest races of the season. It's also the first race of the season. We got to get the cart out. We got to get ready. The selfie of me tripping in the pits. <laughs> we got about a half an hour and then there's the driver's meeting and it looks like we have some time uh, road tax masters on the bottom of the driving order so I didn't need to rush this morning See the paddock is all set up. A couple of changes from last year. So I got a new kit. This is the uh, Milwaukee uh, modular uh, toolbox kit. I really like it. It's good. A little expensive, but good. We have our air, fuel, spare tires. So I got a rain set and a brand new set of uh, slicks. So and then plus we got practice tires. I got my uh, transmitter, which I did not charge last night. Oh my goodness! I have to charge the transmitter. Hold on. I gotta get that going. <laughs> okay, so this is how I set it up. I got the transmitter charging. I forgot to charge that last night. Oh boy. Hopefully we can get enough charge in it that it'll work for qualifying. So that's it. We're just going to go over the cart quickly. Um, I had this cart running on Thursday, so now it's Saturday. Uh, a couple things that we're going to check. It's going to top up the fuel. I'm going to check the air pressures. The, I will check an app to make sure that the jetting is correct. Today I have a um, 122 jet on pin position four in the carburetor. And I think I'm just gonna leave that there for practice. But before qualifying and before the race, I'll probably verify it. The weather conditions will change quite a bit during the day. It is calling for rain today. And uh, it rained last night, so the pavement is, it's not wet, but it's not dry. It's kind of in the middle. So that means we'll be running dry tires, um, at least for practice. Even if it starts raining, I'm gonna run dry tires for practice because I don't want to use the wets. The wets, they don't last very long. They kind of get burned up if it's not that wet out. So uh, I'm gonna save them for qualifying in the race. Even if it's like pouring rain, I'll probably still use the dry tires just for practice. Um, okay, my hair's a mess. A little bit of bed head, because it's gotta get up early to get here. Manzo, how you doing? Hey, how are you? You're on YouTube. Oh, sweet. Smile. I don't know if you guys remember Enzo, Enzo from last year. He's an up-and-comer. He's yeah. going to be kicking ass this year. Yeah, I hope so. You're going to win some times? Yeah, uh, definitely during the WCKC, but we have a long competition here. Yeah. So what are you racing this year? What class? Junior, road tracks, and junior football. This is really fast. They're actually faster than the big fat guys, aren't you? Yeah. 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 They They're actually do la faster lap times. Yeah. So, good. Well, we'll see you around. Yeah, good luck you. today. Yeah, thank you. Okay, who are you? What are you racing this year? Uh, Chris Dabrowski, uh, racing Rotax yeah, Masters again, uh, third season. Uh, super excited to start. Uh, excited to race you, Brent. I'm happy uh, you're doing another season. It's gonna be fun this year. Oh, that's it. Let's go to the pre-grid. They're calling for us. Okay, this is practice. Saturday morning practice. Let's see how it goes.
just finished practice. It was cold, so the first couple laps is getting the tires up to temp. The last uh, couple laps are just getting pie slower, guys. And then uh, I had one good flying lap, and I came in second overall for pace. It's behind by two one hundredths of a second from the from the leader, who was Ronaldo. So Ronaldo's the man to beat today. And everyone's pretty excited because usually I'm kind of middle of the pack and this year being second place is pretty exciting. So uh, what's changed from last year? Well, I got a new motor rebuilt, so that's definitely some of it. And uh, a whole winter of simulator training. I did a lot of simulator racing over the winter and I'm, I'm taking the corners quite a bit differently. And it's, you know, 10th year, 10th there, and it adds up, you know. So, um, I gotta switch to the race rubber now. And I had leaks before, so I gotta make sure that they're not leaking and get them on the cart. And then uh, I'll see if I can get some footage of the racing for you guys. Just to show you how hard it can be to get some of these axles in and out. Sometimes they don't always cooperate. No, they, they don't. <laughs> yeah, that coming out that. Man, he's everything. He's, he's our nice, guy. He's, nice. he's a human Benjamin out here. <laughs> <laughs> Okay, qualifying is done. I was pushing too hard on qualifying. I spun out twice. Once because the sec track is quite rough. And uh, if you're pushing a little too hard on the brakes, it's gonna lock up and send you in the leads, which happened. The other time I was pushing this one corner, I know there's a lot of time there. So I started pushing a little harder and I pushed too hard. Yeah, so it came in fourth, which is normally really good for me. But I'm a little disappointed because I got brand new rubber on and I was not as fast as I was in practice. Ronaldo, hey, the pole sitter. How is it going? Absolutely amazing, man. Well, what's the secret uh, out there, man? Well, the secret is just keep it in the track. <laughs> <laughs> this is four of us all within hundreds of a second. Wow, I didn't realize that. Okay, let's see how the race goes.
starting in fourth. Hopefully I can finish in fourth. My goal is to get a podium sometime this season. It would be really great to do that on the first race, but that's a little ambitious. If I can just finish where I started, I'll be pretty happy. Let's see what happens. Super fun. I'm so disappointed in myself. Oh, so I came in fifth. I had a lot of fun, but I was really frustrated because if I had just kept my nose clean, I would have come in second. I had the pace and I was right there, and then the front two guys took themselves out, so it's just I would have been second in the podium if I had just kept clean myself. That's life, that's racing. We'll try again tomorrow. And there's our champions right there. Smile, guys. <laughs> Congrats.